As the only pure, untainted member of the Black Dragon Flight, I took it upon myself to see that all my corrupted brothers and sisters were destroyed. I sent my new friend into the heart of Gilneas City to destroy Hiram Creed, a black dragon who had corrupted the locals with his own draconic blood. None of Ravenholt's assassins had been able to penetrate into the city, but this one, as silent as a shadow, he moved. With surgical precision, he took his target down. I was very impressed. My companion Farad was not so enamored of my new favorite assassin. <laughs> a lucky blow against an unprepared opponent. I rewarded our hero with a nasty set of matching daggers and the promise of even more power if he could return to me with some spell reagents acquired from Deathwing's minions. To my surprise, he returned, some weeks later, scarred by battle against my father's minions, but eager for another assignment. The gems you collected will be able to augment the power of the weapons I gave you, but I require another ingredient. It will come from your next target. We've just located her here, in the caverns beneath Karazhan. <laughs> Fearful for her life, she is researching arcane secrets buried beneath the Foundation. Her name is Nalus, and until recently she stood at Wormrest Temple as the representative of the Black Dragonflight. Now, she's on the run. She surrounded herself with a small army of deranged dragon cultists. They may not be right in the head, but they're well-armed and dangerous. I hope to see you back from this mission alive. But if I do not, I want to say I've enjoyed seeing you work. You're a credit to your race. Good luck. Confident of my new ally's ability, I sent him after one of the most powerful black dragons I knew to be in hiding. Nalus. Getting to her required running through a gauntlet of minions within the catacombs beneath Karazhan. And, of course, Nalus herself did not go down without a fight. I was pleasantly surprised at our hero's victory, but Farad was again... unimpressed. She allowed herself to be defeated. The others will not be so weak. The black blood of Nalus allowed me to upgrade the vicious twin daggers of my new favorite assassin. He was going to need even more power, however, and for that reason, I sent him back into the fray to collect more resources. Some weeks passed, but he returned, fresh from battle and prepared at last for my hardest assignment. Don't trust this one, your highness. No one is that good. I sent him to kill my father, Deathwing himself. Don't underestimate my father. Even if you were to crush his body, the core of his madness and rage will still struggle to destroy you. He will not be defeated until he is utterly annihilated. I wish I could help, but my father is the one dragon I fear. Best of luck, Rogue. Whatever the outcome, you are truly a champion. To be honest, I expected never to hear from my favorite Rogue again, but I underestimated his legendary abilities.